Hello everyone, welcome to another episode in my Unreal Engine survival series. So here I am going to work on this. So when I press um, inventory button, I, you can see this inventory appears and before uh, it, uh, the mouse didn't appear as I opened the inventory and also the game input was also working. So today when I am going to work on when I press I the mouse will appear and also the game inputs will be disabled only the UI inputs will work and if I press this close button it will be closed and game controls will be returned and also instead of pressing the close button if I press the I button or escape again this will be closed and game controls will be returned the mouse will be will disappear mouse pointer will disappear so those are the two things I am gonna work on today and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me so right before we continue with the inventory so we have to fix something here so if I press I to open the inventory now technically the game inputs should be disabled and the mouse should appear here so then uh, with the mouse I should be able to select these things so only if I press I again it should disappear and the control should go back to the game so how do we deal with this right so let's go to the place so the, re the reason is it is uh, to implement this first before proceeding with the rest of the stuff of the inventory UI is because it makes harder to test if I haven't set up the inputs properly right so okay so if I open my character this is how I open the inventory here I have kept a reference to the HUD which I set in the begin play I get the player controller get HUD and keep it as a reference and then so if you want you can directly use this as well but I just want to make it simpler right and then in the I have defined this input show inventory so if I press it once it will open the inventory if I press it again it will close the inventory okay so here uh, I'm calling this toggle inventory through through the BPI HUD interface and this is my HUD HUD survival in this HUD I have this toggle inventory uh, event implemented through the VPI HUD interface and here it just add the inventory widget to the viewport and if it is false remove from the viewport so this widget inventory is created in the begin play yeah all right so now when we do this we should may in uh, we should set the show mouse there is a set show mouse cursor some event like that yeah ah, we should call it on the player controller get player controller set show mouse cursor and it should disable when we remove it from the widget and also 
we have to set mod uh, to yeah if i set this to ui only then in the ui within the ui itself we would need a close button to close the ui let's use this so yeah let's see what happens here if i now disable it set in mode to game only all right now let's see what happens play i now the mouse appears and the player inputs are not working even if i press moment buttons only these things works all right now the next complication is how do I go back to the game? I haven't implemented a close button for the inventory. So I created this close button. Let's put this into this uh, inventory widget first. So it should be in this corner let's add a button oh yeah it should be this is the vertical box inventory widget border Right, uh, let's add it under the canvas panel. Set the style, the button. It's uh, not visible because it is under the blur. So let's put it here. Right now it is visible. Put it here. And uh, let's draw this as uh, image the size and 9.5 by 0 0.5 as the pivot and position 0 by 0 no oh, it doesn't look very good size to 50 by 50 okay let's leave it for like this for now mm. right what else we have to change oh Let's copy this style. Let's see how it works and figure out next what to do. Yeah, it changes. So Let's copy the same image for Howard. Uh, 
and let's add a slightly gray tint and when pressed the same thing on hover it is slightly gray disabled also same image oh. should be rendered as an image right when it is disabled it should be like this let's see okay for now it doesn't do anything so let's enable the functionality right now for that here let's go to the on click event here get player controller and get hot and then double inventory Call it with the false, right? Okay, now input mode is UI only. If I close this, now the control is back to the game, but we have a problem. Mouse visibility, mouse is still visible let's see why ah. ah sorry i need to make this false and also here i called show inventory and with the flip flop so now that this function is not called again we can't use this flip flop therefore i'll just delete that and call only this right okay now control is back to the game if i press i again again we have the inventory close the control back again all right so yeah with this i'll stop this episode and uh oh wait we need to do one more thing so usually when i open inventory with a uh, with a key input in usual games so if i press i again or esc again this should go back but at the moment we can only close this with this close button so let's see how to do that now so here there is a option when we add a widget into the viewport set keyboard focus let's enable this so i think key inputs should work on the widget now let's go to the widget and here under the function we can there are some yeah on mouse button up so we have this key inputs let's see on key down what are these can we break it no ah we can get the key here equal 
equal all right so here we can see if this is equal to the let's say esc or i so let's select first i duplicate uh, the reason to use i is because i am using i to open the inventory let's say esc oh branch if this is true uh, yeah well we should close the close this widget that means essentially we have to call this function now can we call this function itself I don't think we can so let's just copy this part put here What should return here? I'm not sure what to return here. Can we make ah, okay? Well, I'm not sure about that, but let's check if this works. Press I, it opened. Press I again. It is not going away. Okay. Well, uh, there is another. And right. I didn't know about that. But still it's not working and I'm getting this widget WDG inventories does not support focus. Set P is focusable to true. Hmm. Where do I set that? Right. Let's set this to true and check. Ah, right. Now it is working. So if I press I again, it goes away. See? Now we have it. And if I press I again, now it goes away. All right. So it works with the key input now. Cool. So with this, I'd like to stop this episode at this point. And as always, the project files will be available for download through the Patreon page. So if you would like to support my work, you can get the membership of the Patreon club. Link would be in the description below. And thanks for watching. See you in another episode. Goodbye.